Nice to see you all. Hello and good morning. Do you break out into a sweat when you look in the mirror and notice yet another grey hair or a few more wrinkles? Well, they say that you're as young as you feel. Dorothy races Formula One cars at Oulton Park. And if the traffic's bad, she also drives a Chieftain tank. But then she's only 63. <laughs> Sylvia is a professional model and keeps young by jogging every morning. She's 71. <laughs> Myrtle loves to travel in style. She's recently taken up hang gliding. And she's 75. Morris is studying for another degree. He passed his MA last year, and he's now working on a Master of Philosophy. He's 83. <laughs> and Arthur regularly rides a souped-up Suzuki motorbike to get the shopping, and he's 93. How about that? Very fine, Dorothy. Dor and I've picked up a bit of the floor as well by the looks of it. Dorothy, what are you doing? Well, I, I do anything that people dare me to do. Really? Oh, well, Such as? Tell me some anything. of the dare. Tell me some of the things you've done. Well, we went with the club I belong to, the Golden Adventurers, to a, a racing circuit. And they asked if anybody could drive. And I said, yes. They said, well, would you like to have a go? So I said, yeah. So they took me around in a, a saloon car first and let me drive that to see if I was capable. And then uh, they brought out the racing car. <laughs> they strapped me in it, and I uh, just disappeared into the bottom of the car. <laughs> <laughs> so they had to pack things behind me. Put a few cushions on the Oh, yeah, yeah. I couldn't see a thing. And I had this big helmet on, and, you know, and I was like this, and the top of the car was there. Anyway, they finally fixed me up and um, told me what to do, and. Uh, just sent me off. And how fast do you go? Well, <laughs> I didn't realise I was going as fast as I did because uh, I, I was reading, the, as I thought, the speedometer, which I thought was miles per hour. But it was uh, <gasps> refs. Uh, oh, <laughs> <laughs> and when I thought I was just doing, like, 40 or over 40, I was really disappointed, you know, because I thought, well, you should go faster than this in a racing car. But they told me, you know, if you get to 40, you'll be doing good. What's so good? I thought, well, I, I won't do much more than that. And then when I came back, they told me that it was probably about 80 or something. <laughs> they meant 40 miles an hour, and you were doing 40 revs, which was there. Yeah. Arthur, yeah. You, you drive a bit fast, don't you? Arthur? When I get the chance. Uh, are you fighting age? Are you conscious that you're stemming back the tide of age by doing that? By any of you, by hang gliding mm. and driving fast cars and bikes? <laughs> No. Yeah. Well, I, I, yeah. The more more active you are, you fight in ages. What do you do to stop you to to stop the aging? What are other active things? Well, as I, I'm in the same club as my sister, and the things we do, it gives you a boost. You're on a high. Yeah. It's your adrenaline, and that must keep you young. Are you it looking must. for things to do like yes, that? Yes. Yeah. But it isn't only active things that keep. Right. Tell me. Well, you just said about sex. Yeah. Well, it's really very hard when you're a widow. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, I think, you know... Do you still it's... feel the same, though, as yeah. you're older? Yeah. I feel exactly the same inside as I did when I was 21. And my grandmother used to tell me that when I was young, but I always thought she was terribly old. And I've worked it out yeah. now that at the time when I thought she was really old, she was about 46. Uh, but uh, she used to say, I feel the same inside. Yeah, and I used to think, you can't, because when <laughs> you're old, do. you don't feel the yeah. same. But you do feel the same. Yeah. 